And we just jumped into part two of this video. Oh, I got Tinky Winky at the right minute. Now Walla. Okay, here you go. Had to get rid of that prototype Dipsy. Okay, Poe's starting to move. I was just checking on her. Okay, is Lala there? Nope. Tinky Winky, I got him. Lala, get her. Got Tinky Winky, then I'll deal with Paul. Yeah, and Dipsy usually moves after Paul comes. Yeah, I'll just let Poe bang on the door because I gotta deal with Tinky Winky real quickly. Yeah, because Tinky Winky is kind of more important to deal with than Poe at the second time, so that's why I let Poe bang on the door. Because I didn't want to risk getting killed by her. I didn't want to risk it. And Dipsy just went to camp too, so I just switched the cameras. Got Walla. There's Tinky Winky. I can stop him here. There's Paul. Got her at the right time. Almost out of power, and it's 4 a.m. And I'm out of power, and it's 5 a.m. I don't know if we'll be able to beat this night, but who knows? Ugh, I just ran out of power. Yep, Tinky Winky just killed me. <laughs> I might just deal with Poe at the second time before Tinky Winky. I don't know, because I don't want to lose half my power, I just realized. Alright, so that strategy didn't work out, so I gotta go back to the original one where I deal with Poe first, then Tinky Winky.
Up the Nunu. Got him. Great, I just I just said Yo Fuala, Tingy Winky, and the Nunu. Which means they're triple teaming this tonight. Okay. Oh, gonna come? Yep, she is. Perfect. And I know Dipsy sound too because he makes a beeping sound. Okay, I'm dealing with Paul right now, Ben Tinky Winky. Okay, I'm gonna stop Tinky Winky right here. Okay, good. I thought I lost Tinky Winky, but he came back. Now I gotta deal with Lala. Now Tinky Winky. Ah, oh, I couldn't deal with Paul in time. And I had to deal with the Nunu too, so I'm dead either way. God, the third time is so hard to keep track of Paul. Uh, I'm trying to figure out how to deal with him the third time he comes. I'm gonna go charge my laptop while I'm waiting. Here we go. Now we're ready for the night. And I'm figuring out a way to deal with Poe the third time she comes. That's what I'm trying to figure out.
Oh, and I see Dipsy, so I gotta stop him after I deal with Tinky Winky. Oop, Lala. Damn it, I couldn't deal with Paul. Then Lala. Great, I'm dead either. How does Lala how does Lala kill me right through the door? I feel like that's a bug. How does she kill me when I have a door closed? Probably either I don't know. Maybe I don't react in time in these situations, but I don't know. I feel like it's a bug. I feel like it is. Anyways. Back onto the night. And I forgot to point out there's credits on the screen too. There's a credits button. I forgot about him. I forgot about that one. <laughs> Alright. Gonna give it one more try, and if I can't do it, then I'll take on part... F I'll take on... Part three of the Insomnia Night tomorrow. Hoping that Insomnia Night doesn't take me six parts like with um, not like Night Six did. I mean not Night Six. I mean, I I meant to say I hope it doesn't take me five parts to beat this like with Night Six. And I'm hoping it doesn't take me six parts to do this like I did in Night Four and Five Nights in Nintendo Land, and then 18 parts. And I'm hoping this doesn't take me 18 parts like I did with Night Five and Five Nights at Ronald's. And then Night 4 and Finance Nintendo Land was where I was where I did six parts to beat Night 4. Oh, gotta switch the camera. Almost didn't react in time.
Nope, the Nunu. Get rid of him. I'll smash you to bits if I have to, Nunu. Tipsy. Deal both. Oh, it's five AM and Tinky Wink is coming close. Okay, got rid of Poe just in time. Oh my god, I just beat Insomnia Snight. And it plays the bell, finally. I don't know why it doesn't play the bell on the other nights, instead it plays an alarm clock. Alright, what's next? Do we have a cutscene next? Or what do we have next? It only took me two part. Oh, we got a mini game. Okay. Start the custard machine for the party in the morning. Okay. And then WASDs to move. Oh, so we're playing a mini game. Okay. And I'm playing as Paul. Okay. Uh, it took me t it only t it only took me two parts to beat insomnia tonight, which is a which I'm glad it did and i'm I'm glad and I'm also glad it didn't take me five parts or six or eighteen it only took me two parts yeah because insomnia night only took me a few tries to beat like it didn't take as many tries as night six night six took me several tries that was a nightmare all right so I guess I gotta keep moving I don't know what to do here I gotta gather custard for the custard machine. How do I gather the custard? Oh, here's the other Teletubbies. Hello, Tinky Winky, Dipsy, and Lala. Uh-oh. Invalid... Invalid instruction? What's that? What happened? Oh, we, we just got the credits. Tubbyland Act 1 Rebuilt. Lead director, there's no stake, which I believe he's the creator of this game. I could be wrong. Lead programmer, there's no stake. Characters, models, and PTLD 93 model. Critiolicious. Certain posters, cutout drawings done by Critiolicious, the creator of the Five Nights of Tubbyland 1, 2, and 3. Environment modeling, there's no stake. User interface, there's no stake. 
Voice acting, Pigsty55 as employee number 003. Programming health assistance, GCAN123. Martin Arthur, Hack Game X294. Can I skip the credits? Feedback, Alex. Captain Alex Bonzi and Soltron, which he's the creator of Tubby Land Return. And then Pigsty is a voice actor in Financial Bud Rebooter, for those who don't know. Um, he voices himself and Jerry, the guy who plays. Soundtrack and recomposition, Aiden O'Flynn. Sounds provided by freesound.org. Finance Tubby Land created by, of course, Critty Alicious. Finance phrase created by Scott Cathan. And I can't skip the credits. I was trying to see if I could, but I can't. Teletubbies owned by Ragdoll Worldwide. Thank you for taking part in the wonderful workplace experience from Tubby Land Entertainment. Might have to jump into part three if the credits go on longer. I'm not sure. Because I'm at 23 minutes on my camera, and usually after 22 or 23 minutes, it just jumps into another part, like I did with part two. Alright, so there's the credits. That's it. Alright, so... Oh, and it shows Poe there. A drawing of Poe. That's an interesting drawing. Right, let me see if I can skip the credits now. I think it'll just do it automatically.